Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. If you are a Fire TV user in the UK and you have seen this new live TV tab on your Fire Stick or Fire Cube, you may have been left wondering how this affects you with TV licensing laws in the UK. If you're confused or just need clarification, then I hope this video can help clear up any doubts that you may have as the answer to whether you need a TV license or not can be quite complex. So let's find out some more and don't forget to drop me a comment down below with your thoughts. Let's start off by talking about the new live TV tab that you may have seen appear on your Fire TV device. This new live TV tab on our home screen gives us a centralised location to enable us to access live TV apps and live TV streams faster over the internet without the need for Freeview or an aerial. To use it, you must have compatible apps installed, such as TV Player, as an example. If you're not sure how to use this Live TV tab and you'd like more information, please see my tutorial that you can find in the link above me or in the description below. The Live TV tab is great. We've got a really useful feature that gives us direct access to Live TV right from the home screen. Now that we've got this feature on our Amazon Fire TV devices, does this now mean that it's now essential to have a TV license if you use a Fire Stick? The answer to that question depends on how you use your Fire Stick and what you use it for. In a nutshell, if you are watching any sort of live TV from anywhere, then you do need a TV license. At the moment, it costs £157.50 annually, but will be rising to £159 from April 2021. This image taken from the TV licensing website shows that watching live TV includes watching live TV programmes from ITV Hub, all four, YouTube, Amazon Prime, Now TV or Sky Go. What this means for you is, if you use the Live TV tab on your Fire Stick to watch Live TV, you most definitely need a TV license. If you already have a TV license, then you can use the Live TV tab on your Fire Stick without any worries. If you don't have and don't want a TV license, and you don't watch any Live TV, then my advice would be to not use the Live TV tab. You can even change the layout of your Fire Stick to look something like this, so that you no longer see the Live TV tab and can't be tempted to use it. If you'd like to find out how to do this, you can visit my website firetvsticks.com, go to the Device Help section for Fire Sticks and click on Launchers. Here there are video tutorials on how to install a custom launcher and completely change the look of your Fire Stick. So you might now think that you can use any app you like so long as you stay away from live TV and only watch on-demand content. If you do this, then you won't need a TV license. But this is incorrect. If you have any app that you can record a program and watch later, or if you watch a program on delay, or if you watch or record programs on plus one, plus two, or plus 24 channels, then you also need a TV license. You also need a TV license if you have the BBC iPlayer app installed, regardless of whether or not you use iPlayer to watch live TV. You still need to have a TV license. It says on the TV licensing website that you must be covered by a TV license to download or watch BBC programmes on iPlayer, live, catch up or on demand. If you don't have a TV license, you cannot use the BBC iPlayer app at all, so I would recommend that you uninstall it to keep yourself covered. Most people aren't aware of these changes that were implemented by the BBC in 2016, that the TV licensing rules now cover everything you watch with the iPlayer app, including anything that is not live TV and is on demand. 
Most people are also not aware that the TV licensing laws apply to any device you use to watch live TV. Not just your television, it applies to your streaming stick, Android box, mobile phone, tablet or PC. And if you pay to receive TV with Virgin Media, Sky, BT or TalkTalk, Talk, you also need to pay for a TV license as well. It is also a common misconception that just because you have the ability to watch live TV, you must also have a TV license. The live TV tab on the Fire Stick gives us the ability to watch live TV, but so long as you don't actually use it and watch live TV with it, and you don't watch live TV on any other device, and you do not use the BBC iPlayer app, then you won't need a TV license. I hope that that has helped to clear up the questions and concerns that some of you have raised over this live TV tab now popping up on your UK Fire TV devices. But if you are still not sure, then post a comment down below and I'll try to help. As always, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a like and subscribe to my channel, making sure that you turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any of my latest releases.